Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing good. Today, as part of constellation series, let's see fourth video in constellation, like how we can configure themes in constellation and how can we link to the portal of before going to the video. I would like to share that all the updates related to videos and any job opportunities you can find under my channel posts. So if you scroll down, you can see all the jobs that i have listed uh, across uh, my contacts and uh, you can do your predictions over here and you can participate in the polls that i conduct regularly before going to video i want to share that i am available in top mat now so if you want some pega career guidance or if you want some pega mock interviews or if you want some information on interview question whatever it is you can reach me personally in this top mate you can book a video meeting with me so that uh, i can have one-to-one -one chat with you guys let's get started into the topic so if you see this is a portal and this is the theme they have selected so how we can apply a theme to a portal in cosmos and all like we would be seeing in this video so before that uh, i would like to tell like there is a class OOTB which is having rule UI theme so what are the themes that we have created or what are the themes we have that are present in the application will be listed out over here so for uh, configuring a theme we have to switch to app studio and uh, under settings if you see here you can see themes so how we can uh, link a theme to a portal so if you see here we have some portals defined if you click on portal uh, if you go to configuration of the portal and if you scroll down you can see that theme that is there so this respect to theme uh, is from this pegasus and if you want to switch that uh, this particular uh, portal will be looking like this so like this you have to design your application look and feel with the help of uh, this theme concept in uh, constellation and if you go to settings and click on themes you can see these are the OOTB themes uh, that are packaged uh, in Pega and if you want to add a new theme you click on add and you can give some name example like constellation example click submit as there is a gap uh, space it is showing like this so this is a theme that is there and if you see this is the font and if you want to have more bigger font and with uh, some other font family you can select this and style this is branding and if you want to update a branding to another color you can uh, do that change and this is a uh, interactive items this also you can change and this is borders now borders is having this color now if you want to upgrade it to this you can give it and this is a uh, main text so what color you want to view for the main text suppose you want to give some other color you can see that text color is updated and it is input borders and uh, here this is link link is having blue color right let's change this blue color to some other color see this link is changed and uh, and what is this uh, access board yeah i will tell you this uh, token creation also so if you if you get an error you try to change to some other token and this is background now content background is uh, white now we can change that uh, content color also like that and uh, you can define buttons also so here if you see buttons primary and uh, secondary buttons so if it is a branding button you can give a branding button and give an outline and uh, suppose this interactive button you can give this and what is the button radius so now it is selected as pill if you want to give small you can give this if you want to large you can do the change based on your application needs and this is small this is a medium now uh, before clicking save for this let's uh, switch back to dev studio once so here if you see constellation video this is our team it created and it is final internal and here it don't have anything now let's uh, switch back to app studio 
and you click save the, you have done some changes from the otb provided thing and you click on save so you done with your changes and now you switch to dev studio again refresh this see the changes that you have done uh, a json is built so normally we used to have some css uh, configuration right like in the same lines uh, under this rule ui theme you can see the customizations that you that you have done so this base we have changed the font size family palette color components and in buttons we have changed color secondary color and border radius also we have changed this form control and link color we have changed and this is card color so these are the things that you have changed now you can go to app studio and you go to portals under configuration you can give constellation and you just click on preview see the this colors and all we change which is previously a different color and uh, in this way you can customize your themes now switching back to channels click save okay now uh, i would like to uh, another pega pdn page where uh, we can see digital tokens that can be configured in pega so once you are done with the changes right you can launch the portal we have uh, applied to this channel portal see our changes can be seen so in this way you can uh, view uh, your themes that can be applied based on your business needs and you can see in the button shape and all that we have done and this is the link this link also we can revalidate that the color is changed to another color and this is the page like uh, design.pega.com extend theme so this uh, link i will be sharing in the video description so this uh, is nothing but theme and tokens uh, so what are the theme the, this particular themes right these are uh, nothing but tokens that they have given uh, these attributes so these are the theme properties like base uh, theme properties and uh, what are the colors properties we have and this is the palette so in the palette also what is the background api and all and these are font family how what are the attributes that we can define and this is the component in the component what uh, like link avatar badges button all these comes under components things and uh, under palette uh, there are some elements that would be covering and uh, this one based on your constellation version suppose you are on pega 8.8 your constellation version is 3.2.2 if you are 23.1 4.01 if you are pega 24.1 application uh, like pega version it's pega constellation 6.0.4 the latest is pega 24.2 and constellation is 7.0.5 and uh, this uh, link if you go through you can see uh, by using live demo and you can do the changes as well and these are the colors uh, where, which are the neutral colors and what are the different colors in the palettes like red orange green blues purple and what are the palette colors we can use and what are the font sizes so it's like a you know previously we used to have ui gallery so this is a kind of a replacement of ui gallery with the constellation design token system this is very useful for us and see if you want to do time animation transparency shadow so like this these are the concepts based on your pega application version if you switch it you should get it i don't know maybe there is a glitch in the pages so these are the things you can uh, see uh, like a ui gallery uh, this is a pega design uh, the theme and tokens page i hope you understood uh, one of the concept in
pega concept so like pega constellation concept like after uh, portals this would be a continuation video for the themes so stay tuned for more uh, about constellation video to this channel thanks for watching this video hope you have liked the content please feel free to subscribe to this channel and uh, check community tab for regular updates and click on bell notifications